Hey there, Rulers. Demo73 here, bringing you the deck profile for the Fish Drive TK from Paul Clute. Let's go ahead and jump right in. This session brought to you by Odyssey Games for pre-orders and sealed product, CCG Prime for tons of singles and supplies, Cardo Doco for international rulers looking for product, and FoulLibrary.com for articles and wonderful deck lists. It's also brought to you by our guest lecturer patrons, Vite Ramen. Class is in session. So this is the list. We built it on untapped today. Uh, let us know. We've been trying differences between force of wind and untap, which let us know in the comments which version of the deck profiles you like better, and we'll go for a word from there. That way, it helps us give us feedback. But this is Olivia. The whole idea of this list is to use Sprinting Steward with Fish Drive and Warhorse and all the searches that we get to just kind of kill your opponent on turn one. It's a silly little idea of... Uh, if Origins is banned and Horse is combo banned, what else can you do with Horse? Uh, so this is the idea. We talked about it on the podcast and we saw it played out with by Paul. Um, it's pretty straightforward, uh, but let's go into it. Olivia, Thunder Empress, being able to get us a dolly and you know, make things non-random so that we can then make fish drive non-random um and that also gets us you know a war horse because dolly's got uh is searched from the deck with the god art and then we'll go into the rest of the pieces here from there so magic stone of tides and then one light vapors four hearts core and one deep wood stone base wise this probably should just change to a like 10 blue red sources just so you always have the opportunity to be able to um go for the uh sprinting steward on early games but you also do need green because you need to be able to play things like sparkle fish or uh, pulsing thunder as needed and then the rest of the deck is like a lot of searching it's just a lot of search pieces to be able to get a bunch of war horses so four copies of war horse two copies of fifth boon lightning bow um because it's very nice to be able to just like say oh you have a nice board of never end stuff let's just pay and bounce you know pay two total and just bounce everything back to your hand especially since everything has eternal which is really nice also hits everything so it also can hit additions which gets rid of wall which is very nice Surging Lightning is her main spot removal. Sprinting Steward, obviously, for the combo. Sealed one Eye Dragon for draw power and spot removal to get rid of things like Darkness Witch, uh, so that we can make sure to get our dollies and our searches off. Two Pulsing Thunders for clearing the board. One Mariabella because she searches out anything. So we, we have a lot of little, like, tech, silly one-of search pieces because those are also going to get us horses. Fish of the Demonic World just as another option. Three copies of Fish Drive to swim the board. Three copies of Dolly. Two copies of Cinderella, and that's because we're playing two mass prints. Um, so the cute thing is, like, off of Thunder Empress's Strike, you can search for a masked prince, which then is then also going to search for a Cinderella. Same thing with Doll, um, with Mariabella. Like, you get like two searches, so Thunder Empress Strike becomes four bodies because you two get two fish or, or two um, horse off of it. It's very silly for two will at instant speed. Two copies of Sparklefish, three copies of the mass produced knight of the round table so that you cast one and can search for others. And then lastly, two copies of Viola because, you know, with Red Child running around, it's nice to be able to just say, hey, I can still put something back on the bottom of the deck. Uh, it, that doesn't get protected by Fire Moon Child. So that is the deck. It's pretty straightforward. It's very, very silly. Uh, we thank Paul for being able to play it and kind of showcase it on the channel. Uh, sorry for the delays in getting it to you guys. Let us know your thoughts about these um, off-the-wall what-else-can-horse-do lists uh, in the comment sections down below, as well as letting us know whether you prefer uh, untap or Force of Wind deck profiles moving forward. And until next time, this is DMO73 saying, class dismissed.